Today I show you how to restart your Samsung Galaxy Android phone. This is the Samsung Galaxy S23 Ultra, but they are very similar on how they work. And to restart, you can use the power menu and to get to the power menu, you either use the pull down menu. Two times you have to pull down from the top of the phone and then you have the power menu here. You can choose the restart option there. Or you can go into settings to make sure you have the power button set to the power menu and not the Bixby. So in Samsung Galaxy phones, there is this option. There is this assistant Bixby and you can wake Bixby with the left with the side button. It's actually the right button here. So this is the power button that is also acting as the Bixby wake function and the volume up and down. And there is a way to open the power menu by pressing the volume down and power at the same time and doing a long press. If you do a short press, it will take a screenshot. But if you do a long press, it will show you the power menu. You do something like this. You keep your finger like that. And this is actually you could take a screenshot. I just took a screenshot now. But if you wanted to show the power menu, if you want to restart the phone, you long press both of them at the same time the volume down and power and that's the option to restart and another way to do it if you have the power button i call it the power button but they call it the side button the press the power button a long press on the power button if you do a short press on the power button it will just lock the screen lock the phone but a long press will open the power menu where you can do the restart you can also power off the phone from here but to restart, all I have to do is press on the restart button. These are the option options and the power power menu. It's really the same for whichever way you use it. Press on the restart button and wait for the phone to restart. You might want to do this when the phone becomes a bit slow. Some app is might get stuck. It's uh, not responding properly. After the restart, you have to enter your passcode. It, the fingerprint will not work. And now the phone is ready to use. So you can use any of these options. They are all doing the same thing. Thanks for watching. Let me know if you have any questions about Android phones or in general about phones. Thanks for watching.